In this video, I'm gonna show you five ways that I actually use to make thousands of dollars a year making music, and now you can do that too. Let's get into it. So the first way you can make money with your music is probably the most obvious, and that's just through actually selling or streaming your music. Now, you should be doing this yourself on your own website and through Bandcamp, but you should also have your music on like iTunes, Spotify, uh, Deezer, Apple Music, all these different places, because it's gonna make up a substantial amount of your, of your income with your music sales. Now, in particular for me, Spotify brings in by far the most amount of money in direct music consumption. So I use DistroKid and I've done videos on that in the past. I'll put a, a card up top so you can check that out. And I do have an affiliate link in the description if you wanna join, it's only 20 bucks a year. So the second way you can make money with your music is through licensing. And this kind of encompasses a lot of different categories. So one way, which is pretty popular online, is selling beats. Uh, basically, this means you're selling instrumentals for people to rap over or sing over. And there's plenty of websites you can use uh, Airbit, BeatStars, and a couple other, I don't really do this, but people make a ton of money, like full-time livings, and they start their own companies just selling beats. Now, the next thing is you can try to get into one of these more exclusive stock sites. For example, uh, Artlist is one, Epidemic Sounds is another, but then there's also these kind of more open ones like Pond5. I'm blanking on the other ones, but I'll, I'll, I'll put a thing on screen listing them. Now, the third way you can make money with music is in the form of teaching. As a music creator, you have a wealth of knowledge that a lot of people want to know. Now, if you just started, this might not be as relevant, but even if you've only been doing it for six months, there's value to be gained from someone who's just gotten through the beginner stages that they kind of understand where you're coming from. So even if you're pretty new, you can still try to find like people who haven't even started yet and try to teach them something that you know that they're struggling with. And this can come in the form of in-person lessons. This can be webcam lessons. I, I do some virtual Skype lessons. You can do full-blown video courses. You can either upload them through like a, a site that you sell or you can license courses to a company to sell. Then of course there's YouTube. If you're good on camera and you're fine waiting a long time, being able to get monetization status and build up an audience, uh, then YouTube is a great way to make some kind of passive income from your knowledge as a musician. The fourth way you can make money with your music and it's actually the most money that I make for my music is through digital products. Now, this can be anything from a sample pack to a contact library to a preset pack uh, or like presets for a hardware synthesizer. It can be whatever you want. Now, I mentioned in the intro, Andrew Southworth, GeneraStudios.com. Genera Studios is my sample pack, contact library, preset pack company. So if you want to check it out, go to GeneraStudios.com and you can see what I have to offer. And if you're a musician, whether you're a guitarist or vocalist, a producer, you can start making these products right away and start selling them. Now it takes a little bit of work to actually set up your store and get things running and learn about the advertising world and all that stuff. But you can make a substantial amount of money doing this. And once you get it rolling, it just kind of starts to bring in regular income. I'm not gonna say that it's it's like this, like get rich quick scheme because it's not, but you make some products and they continually make you money. And if you were to do this full time, I think you could easily make enough money to sustain a living. Now the fifth way you can make money with music is what I'm bundling as work for hire. Now this can be either, let's say you're a vocalist and you, you want to sing on someone else's track, you can go on various websites, I'll put links in the description, where you can, someone will hire you either hourly or for a certain project to record vocals or maybe to record guitar. And you can also extend this if you're not a musician per se, but you're a producer, you can also do mixing and mastering work. And I actually also do this as well. You know, I, I don't do it like as a main business, but every so often people will message me and say, hey, I have this song, do you wanna mix it? Do you wanna master it? And if I like it, I say yes, and I do it and we agree on a price. So you can do the same thing. Now you can also make a full blown website for your mixing and mastering services and advertise it on Facebook and try to bring in like daily clients and make a ton of money. And people do this for a living. You can either, you can do it in person if you want, or you can do it all virtually online if you want. And, you know, as I said, people make full-time livings as mixing mastering engineers or as session musicians. So as you can see, there's, there's a good amount of ways you can make money with your music. And some of these don't actually require any extra work at all. But if you want any further elaboration into these methods, just let me know in the comments. And if there's any other topic in making money with your music that, that you wanna see me talk about, uh, just also let me know in the comments. Make sure to subscribe for more because I upload videos every single Tuesday and Friday. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.